Okay. Guys, this is how you start a race. Okay, this is where all your hard work getting the team to the start can go horribly wrong. So, like any other race, you need to be on a road bike. Okay, when you're on the road bike, you get the draft effect. If you're on a time trial bike, you don't get the draft effect, which defeats the whole object. Right so, this guy's on the start line. Everybody's on the start line ready to go. Um, so, you will get a start time at 7 p.m. tonight. So, all team captains will get a start time 7 p.m. tonight. So, let's say your start time is 7. It will say your start time might be 7 plus 8 minutes, or 7 plus 12 minutes, or 7 plus 30 minutes. So at 7 o'clock, when the gate says go, do not go unless you your start time is at 7 exactly, which I very much doubt it. You need to go off your start time at 7.08 or 7.09. So what's going to happen here, you'll see here now. So they start, and the individual riders will go off. So they'll shoot off now, and everyone else is going to sit and stay there. Okay. Nobody should pedal at this point. Okay. If your start time is 7:05, then once the start is at seven, someone needs to start a stopwatch. So it'll either be the team captain or the uh, person on Discord, and wait for five minutes. When five minutes is up, then you can start pedaling and go. Okay. So you can see it saying go, 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 and everybody's sat here on the start line. That's what you need to do. You need to just sit there on the start line waiting until that particular start time. That start time will be a WTRL under events, under your start time, and it'll say 7 o'clock plus 8 minutes, plus 10 minutes, whatever it is. That's when you go, is that 7 or 8 minutes or whatever your start time is after the go point at 7. It sounds a bit complicated, but it, it, it's pretty easy. So you got to sit there and do nothing. Okay. Issue is, if you've got a start time, 30 minutes after the actual 7 p.m. start time then you got to sit there for, and not pedal for 30 minutes well you don't have to do that all you have to do and this is what the team managers or the people on the discord need to tell them is that you go into menu right go into your pair screen okay and then leave it in that position Right on. Okay, so you need to leave it in that position in the pair screen and then you can pedal and you can continue to warm up Okay right on. When you start right two on. minutes before you start time I suggest you stop till that power right drops on. down to zero right in your pair screen right on. And then come out of it go back into, right into your race don't right end anything right just on. you know Just right exit that on. the pairing screen and go back in and then don't pedal for two minutes before you start at least You know you're ready to go what's happened in the previous as well in, in, in a race last week is I actually somehow um, stopped pedaling and, and it came out of the pairing and I, and, I, and I wasn't paired halfway through the race so all as I did is went back to that pair screen and hit hit the pair and paired my turbo and about 15 seconds later I was back in the race but at least I was 15 seconds behind and then everybody waited for me okay so don't be going oh I'm, I'm out I'm out I'm not moving and, and, and panic don't panic don't don't jump up your bike and see if your your turbo's plugged in just go back into the pair screen pair back in and then then you're sorted so let's just go move forward to when this guy is actually going to start so we'll watch him start his actual race okay so he's gone off there now so this has been quite a long wait so right off he goes so this is his team going now yeah you can see them all shooting off there he is and this is the team coming together and lucky he's luck lucky that he's got um, eight of them yeah and off they go into the time trial one of the things I forgot to mention is those people on discord what you need to do is you need to watch somebody. So you need to enter that same race that your team is entering if you're on Discord and actually watch somebody in that race. So for example, this guy here, he's watching um, the Evo Warriors and you can see watching S. Bale. So he's gonna be watching that whole race. But as 
you need to enter that same race as your team if you're on the Discord channel and, and you're the, one of the coaches coaching. You need to enter that same race at the same time so that you can be on the start line and then you can see one of your guys and then you just touch the screen, you know, there and then you'll end up watching that person. Okay? Hopefully that helps.